<laughs> that won't work, master! That won't work! <laughs> Perfect! We're on the counters! We have the unblockability! We're gonna buff him up so much, so we're gonna big, big hit him! Oh, uh, Scabba! Hun! Hun! No, 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 no! <laughs> there it is! Nine damage! Boom! <laughs> Stealth, mentals, 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 stealth, mentals. Isn't that the coolest name of a deck? No, it's not, says everyone. Well, well, I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> Playing stealth mentals today. What does that even mean? Of course, we're gonna play stealth mission. Put two plus one plus encounters on target creature you control. That creature can't be blocked this turn. So this has a couple of uses actually in this deck. So first, uh, it's great for something being unblockable, of course. But then you can also put it down on the Dreadled Arcanist, which is the only non-elemental non creature in the deck. And when you put it on this guy, he can play it again, and he will become a 5-7 unblockable for that turn, which is pretty amazing. He will retain the counters, of course, which means that he can attack it again and again and again. And he can play more things from a graveyard, such as Quasi Duplicate, which can copy Arisen Reefs and stuff like that. We also have Thunder Can Awakener. When he attacks, you target elemental creature card in your graveyard with toughness less than Awakener's toughness. Return the card to the battle with. So if you have Stealth Mission on Thunder Can Awakener, which can play on the same turn because it's not that expensive. It's like five mana. You can return your Omnath, for instance, from your graveyard, or if you can get down Stealth Mission plus Vivian or uh, something, buff it up a little bit more, then you can get a Cavalier of Thorns. And the same thing with Royal Siren. Sometimes you can just buff Dreaded Arcanist enough so that you can play this Stealth Mission or the Quasi Duplicate from the graveyard, especially since you're gonna mill yourself with Cavalier of Thorns. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much deck. It's like an elemental reanimator weird deck, but it works out great. Let's just jump into the game, shall we? Lord Orphan will be our first opponent. Well, Orphan, I'm sorry what happened in the past, but let me take it down there. You take it down with the elementals. You go first. This looks like a good hand, honestly. Keep it. Keep it, keep it, keep it. Keep it, keeps it, keep it, keep it, keeps it. Boom, boop. Ooh, it's 96%. <laughs> Chinese boss of mine. MLG Pro has five mythic championships under his belt. Now, it's facing up against Stealth Mentals. Is that the, uh, the word? <laughs> the name you give it? Yes, that's the name I give it to the deck. Stealth Mentals. This is stealthy. Look at this. If this guy could stealth, that would be very, very dangerous. <laughs> this guy's a freaking mountain. <laughs> Why is he a 1-1, one -one, though? How is it that a cat is a 1-1? One -one? And this freaking monstrosity can die to a cat. The cat needs to be huge. It's like a mountain coming out of an ocean. Ah, it doesn't make sense. Magic doesn't make sense, I made that clear. Okay, um... Okay. Don't have an instant of sorcery, so this guy's not gonna do it. I think we're just gonna, you know... Put down this guy. We could also put down the royal science, I guess, but, you know. It's pretty sweet. If we hit a land there, we can maybe go Cavaliers next time. Hit a land! Hit a land! Yes! Yes! <laughs> Again. <laughs> if you have a partner, uh, he or she is probably saying... <laughs> uh, what are you watching? What are you watching, honey? Okay. He plays it, but he doesn't block! <laughs> he could have played it afterwards! But he didn't. This guy... <laughs> It's a genius dingus. Well, thank you. Well, I'm gonna try to play this. Mm. And uh, see what this gives us. This gives us... Ooh, and a land. I thought it would have a Knutus, by the way, but it didn't. And that I'm very happy for. And let's see here. We put down... Put down the man 10. Uh, we can't use the manas anyway, so we put this on that. Dun, 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 dun. Let's see, did we hit anything? Thunder can awaken. We didn't really hit anything there. This guy's probably gonna go up to a 2 with 3, so I think we're just gonna. No, no attack it. In Diamond Cutthroat number 2. Ah, they're gonna be. In time, they will be a force to reckon with. Now they look tiny. <laughs> That's my narrating voice, if you want. No instant sorceries. No. Oh, when I think about it. Nah, nah, it's still not worth going in. Gonna go in with this. And see what it does. 
Doesn't do anything about that. Okay, so we could play this and... We could play the Cavalry of Thorns, which is probably the bigger threat. So we gotta put this down. He's probably gonna counter this. Probably gonna counter it. Okay, that's fine, apparently. Weird, okay, well, draw this card. Draw and discard. I think this guy can go. Because uh, <laughs> these Cavalry of Thorns are pretty ballers as well. So. Mm. Oh, we had a quench, that's why. That's why it didn't work out before for him, okay. Well, now we know, he's a quencher. A quencher of sorts. Lord Orf is a quencher. Has quenched many a quench. Now, these don't have cramp or anything. Uh, we could get rid of the Brimeborn Cutthroat, this guy. Could s <laughs> double block here, I guess. Or... Or, we could suicide the Arcanist. Uh, why is this guy tapped? Oh, he has reach. I thought he had vigilance. Okay. Now it's better to have this, because this is gonna draw us cards next turn, so... Yep, look like this. Ooh, Omnath Locus of the Royal. Well... Here's what they start off with, I think. Give this guy first strike and trample. Yes! Yes, 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 yes. And then, go in with Cavalier. And see if he has anything. The big creatures of any sort. Or he's gonna take seven. Okay. He bounces it. Interesting. Well, he is growing his, uh, his population of dorks, I guess. Uh, why is he using all the green manas for this? Same with this. Interesting. Uh, why wouldn't you use... Manas like this, for instance. But I'm wondering. Uh, wait, if we don't hit a land with this, that's not the best way to tap, actually. Uh, we should probably tap like this. One, two. Boonk. 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 Because now if we hit a land with this, we can still on the local. Okay. Vivian, that's pretty sweet. Uh, so, let's see here. We put this down, or we could just take the island, I guess. Yes, take the island. Then put down the Omnip. Kill this guy. Uh, take that action, yes. Tapped. The counter on you, I guess. Wink. And that's pretty good. <laughs> Lord Orphan. He's in trouble now. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Simic Flash. How I love it to slay them. Joker 0351. Of course. 90% of the Mastermind. We only play against Masterminds. <laughs> masterminds. 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 Uh, this is perfect. We have stealth mission with Dreadnought Arcanist. I don't think Arcanist. Arcanist? I, I think he's gonna die immediately. Well, you know, you really hope that he doesn't. Because if he doesn't, this Camboner is pretty sweet! And look, he has quasi Oh! Oh! <laughs> you think you're gonna get this off? Probably not. Maybe if he's mono red, he might not have the chance to kill the Dreadlord Arcanist. Because he might not have enough burn early enough. And that should. That would be pretty good, guys. If he's... If that's black, he probably can't kill this. Probably. If he's white, he probably can kill this. Oh, he might not be able to. Drulian sometimes, they usually only run the uh, two damage spell. So it might not be enough. I wanna see. We're not gonna block the pellet collector. We're not gonna, not gonna risk the entire operation. Two manas. The, probably the only thing he could have here is the... Uh, the giant, which has two damage. Other than that, I think we have a chance here to get the stealth mission. Come on, don't have it. Yes! Yes! Stealth mission! Here it is! I don't think there's any two mana spell that can save you here. Mister. Mister, mister. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. Oh! I just play it again. Play it again! Play it again, and play it again, and play it again. 
is how you do it. Stealth mission number two. Which can't be blocked this time. It's now officially a 5-7. <laughs> Bad da dunk! Yeah, you need something, here, mister. You really need something. I tell you that much. Something huge. Well, I guess he could just... He could just put down enough pressure on the board and kill me. That's one of the doing things, but... <laughs> he might also not do that. Who knows? Okay, let's do that. I think... Ooh, the Royal Scions. Man... Uh... Here's what I think we'll do. We'll go in with the Arcanist. I don't think he's gonna block, but we'll see if he blocks. Oh, oh it has trample also, so it's not not the best idea, maybe. But put this down. Take that action, yes. Ooh, perfect. I will gain a life also. And tapped. So we could have the Ember Cleave now. Go in both Ember Cleave. Uh, but I kind of want the Risen Reef to die, because then I can Thunder can awaken and. Nah, that's not true. It would be better if it's alive. I can cause a duplicate. And Thunder can... Uh, well, doesn't matter if it dies so much. Doesn't really matter. Okay, I keep that on the blocks. Interesting, interesting. Well, I'll take two. It's not enough to play Amber Cleave. It's only four mana, so... So, no blocks. I'll take two. I think we're gonna get the jump. We're gonna get him. I think we're gonna put a smile on that face. <laughs> put a smile on my face, maybe. Probably not on Joker's face. Who gets the laugh? last laugh? Isn't it always the Joker, you say? Well, sometimes it's just me. Who gets the last laugh? That's just how it is. Just how it is. Joker 0 3 5 1, then. It's gonna have her. Big business stuffs. Uh, what are we gonna try? We're gonna try to cross duplicate the Risen Reef. Because even if he kills it here, then we can Thunder can awaken it back, and we can cause a duplicate if we stack the triggers correctly. So it's fine. Should he kill the Risen Reaper? Oh, really though? Oh, that's it okay. Interesting, interesting. Then we got double Risen Rapper's triggers. Okay. And we're gonna take that action, yes. Play tapped. And then, and go in with both these. Do we also put down the Royal Science? No, we don't have enough blue. We don't have enough blue. And Thunder can awaken there, can't return anything. But it can deal one damage. <laughs> and that's not the worst. Yeah, that's it. Thunder can awaken her also. Yep, here we come, mister. Oh, it's also an elemental. That's... <laughs> That's quite good, I've heard. That is going pretty well. Going pretty well. Pretty well, I missed it. I mean, uh, the Dreadnought Arcanists plus Stealth Mission. It is pretty good, still. It's it's pretty strong, especially against the red base decks, like Gruul, Mono Red. That's pretty much the only deck is very good, I guess. <laughs> Anything that contains black can just kill this. But uh, if they don't contain black, they haven't been tainted by the black, by the dark sources. Oh, Joker, he doesn't like this. And I'm so happy he doesn't. I'm so happy I can crush some scrubs. <laughs> Where is my... Where is my poetry? God damn it! Poetry, you're hiding again. <laughs> don't hide from me. <laughs> Look. I'm like the dad you see in some uh, some drama who beats his kids or something. <laughs> uh, <laughs> let's see. Okay. Well, we gotta go in. For all that damage. All of it. All of it. It pretty much needs to block this, else it dies. Well, it could block this, I guess. Could. But then again... Maybe. Oh, he just times out there. Okay. Gonna cause a duplicate. Yes. What are we gonna cause a duplicate, though? Probably recent rappers. Get even more sniffing snappers. <laughs> the sniffing snapper party. 
Sniff and snap party. That. Oh, he's down to one. Unless he has some pretty big business there. I don't think he's turning this around. Mmm. Joker 0351. Stealth mantles. <laughs> you really like that name, but it came up with I know I like it a little bit too much. It does, it's not even that good of a name. I just liked it. Stealth mantles. Maybe. I create a company called Stealth Mentals. It's uh, it's a thing with elementals and mental. I don't know. <laughs> you don't have to explain your dangerousness. What are we holding him? Penumbral. You, sir, are a penumbral man. <laughs> a penumbral performance. <laughs> what does that even mean? I don't know. What does penumbral even mean? And other mastermind have we only faced up against masterminds? 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 Deja vu? No. I just said it two times. <laughs> Is that deja vu? No, I just said it two times. <laughs> I imagine some, some old French movie or something. Back in the day when humor wasn't as evolved as it is right now. Well, well. <laughs> Well, some things might not... I don't know. The meme compilations is the... Uh, absolutely tip of the top of... Uh, of humor, I don't know. Maybe it is. I've been watching a little bit of Suit House. If you haven't checked out Suit House... Oh. I don't know what it is. It just... It hits on a spot where it's just too funny. Not You, you can't... Just try and not laugh at it. Just try. Just, just give it a go. Why would I try and not laugh at it? Just... Yeah, I got some dingus logic there. I don't know exactly why you would do that. Can't really answer. <laughs> what is blue or oh, red, white, what? Red, white, uh, okay, no, oh, it's... What, what the crack? Oh, it's probably a uh, fire zone mansion, I guess. I could easily kill this. But I don't mind putting on a stealth mission on this. I need man. I need a man, I say. Because later on we're gonna we're gonna get some uses out of that of that thing. Oh, okay. Well, that thing is not gonna work anymore. That's good. That's good. Okay. There's a round though. That's gonna work. Unfortunately. Ooh. Oh, is it my almost the deck that I created? Fire some invention, theater of horrors. It could be. That would be pretty cool. I won't, I won't admit. Uh, do we now put down the Royal Science? Or do we put down Omnath? I think we put down Omnath. Because the thing is... <laughs> we're also down to 40. It's all new lands. Yeah, one damage. Because the thing is, we can... If we go Thunder can awaken a Royal Science, we can't... No, we can't return it. We can't damn. We can do it with Vivian, but we can't do it with Royal Science, of course. We can go Thunder can awaken a Stealth mission, though, and we can return Omnath with, in that way. That's pretty cute. That's pretty cute. Kills it. Kill it with a black spell. Please don't freaking prison realm. Don't exile my stuff, penumbral. <laughs> don't you dare exile my stuff. That's exactly what I wanted you to do. Actually. Exactly what I wanted you to do. Okay. Put this guy down. This string down. This string down. And this string down. And go in and smack him. For some damage. Oh. Not a five. That's slippery at least. Well, definitely would work. Needs something. Something a little stronger. Hopefully doesn't have yet another removal. This guy seems to be packing exclusively removal though. Well, let's see. Don't touch giant. Times two? Of course, times two. Why wouldn't it be? Oh shit. Well, all we know about this guy is that he loves removal. He loves it. <laughs> There's nothing he doesn't love about removal. Uh, God darn it. <laughs> I guess this. Tapped. Unfortunately, this guy is amassing a lot of stuff in there. Atlas Merriment, Murdify. Okay, Atlas Merriment. Now he needs to. Ooh, okay, Dreadlord Arcanist. That's not the worst. 
That's certainly not the worst. Hmm. I think we go with this. Oh, wait, we go with that. Uh, we go this. It doesn't have haste, so let's go plus. I will learn what nobody yet knows. Eww. Well, of course, duplicate can definitely go to the graveyard, so do that. Put down this and put down Vivian and plus Vivian on this guy. Smack! Smack! Turn. That is pretty good because now it's he's unblockable also. If he gets to go in though, versus Penumbral. As a question, does he have yet another Renoval? <laughs> Definitely Clarion. How many things? Definitely Clarion. Mortify, Bone Crushy Giant. Uh, well, he's had all only removal, so I would be surprised if he doesn't have yet, yet another removal. What do I have in the sideboard? I don't remember what I put in the sideboard. Maybe I forgot to put the sideboard together. Because that could be quite crucial now when he has 5 HP. <laughs> That's gonna go minus with this and maybe find something there. Finale 4, that won't work. Yes! Yes! <laughs> that won't work, mister! That won't work! <laughs> Perfect! On the counters, we have the unblockability. We're gonna buff him up so much that we're gonna big, big hit him. Oh, uh, Scabba. Hun! Hun! No, 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 <laughs> There it is! Nine damage! Boom! <laughs> Stealth! Mentals! Stealth! Mentals! Stealth! Mentals! Stealth! Mentals! Demon Wisp! Oh! A scrub! <laughs> this is where we're gonna be, though, I promise you. We're playing up against someone has such a weird strategy where you're gonna be like. He's gonna just crush us. Demon Whispers. First of all, that's a cool name. I have to make that clear. Demon Whispers is a cool name. Why, why is it a cool name? I have to com uh, complain. <laughs> okay, some complaints. Uh, the weather. <laughs> now, let me explain about the name. Demons are cool. By definition, they're cool. Why are they cool? You ask. Nobody asked that. <laughs> we all know they're cool. <laughs> uh, okay, is this... No. I'm not gonna fall into the trap of thinking that this is ghoul. 75% demon whispers does not simply play ghoul. Also whispers, by the way. It's pretty cool. Why is whispers cool? And why is whispers cool? Well, if you whisper in a teeny voice, it's pretty cool, isn't it? <laughs> no, it's not. So several. Wow. Lady Q. I think it's I think Lady Q. Now we are in a weird situation where we have a stealth mission. Uh, we have stealth mission, but we only have Rizzery. We don't have our uh, carriers for the stealth mission. A uh, double red one, of course. Well, when this guy goes off, uh, he will go off with a bang. Are we gonna buff? Is this gonna be the Risen Reef? The largest Risen Reef there ever was? Could do that. You could just put down Omnath also. Could be probably smarter. And uh, deal damage. I'm very afraid though, I must say. Ooh! Okay, that's that's the guy we needed. That's our man. That's here. That's Earth. That pay blue dot. Uh let's see here. We put a I think we put a cannon on it. I think this guy needs all the protection he can ever get. Okay, triple rhythm. Uh, well, I am scared, mister. I am scared what's coming down here. What's coming down is both gonna be huge and it's gonna be fast. And fire some imagine. Okay, well, now he's geared up. That's a big Torben. <laughs> That's a big Torben, not gonna lie. Pretty big Torben. Um, okay. So we can kill it with Vivian, right? Can we? If we put down Vivian and Stealth Mission, no, we can't put down both. Rack. <laughs> Rack. I could also go in with Omnath. No, that doesn't work. Is there any way I can deal more damage to it? 
probably is a way. But I'm really not seeing it right now. Yeah, well, we'll put down this. Can put a counter on Omnath. It's almost big enough to deal with it. Well, we can do a little bit of switcherooner. Wait, if we put down this, eh, it's still not enough. Um. Oh, actually, we could hit a land with this. We could hit a land with this with Risen Reef on top, which buffs Omnath. No, we didn't. We did not. Okay. Oh, that's problematic. That is problematic. Well, maybe we can hit a land with this. And maybe we'll survive Torben somehow, some way. Okay. Come on. Yes, that's good. So Omnath is now big enough to survive this. This attack. And uh, we'll go in with Omnath. We'll go in with the Risen Reef. But it's fine if it kills the Risen Reef. We can just return to the farm again. I don't think it's gonna block with Torben. Oh, well, the Risen Reef, of course. But... Boink. Perfect. Well, I think... <laughs> I think this is where we fall, because I think this guy has a plan for Torben. Probably. Well, that is dangerous. That's... Lot of damage, some would say. Someone call this lot... <laughs> right, that's right. Haste, text proof, riot, trample. Yeah, yeah, that, 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 that's very, 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 very much damage. Well, this guy doesn't have trample. So this guy needs to get blocked. <laughs> very much. This guy's deal uh, 17... What's this? 14 damage, but that's not enough, not enough to kill me, and he dies next turn. So this should be fine. Oh, we're down low, but we kill him now. Oh! Oh! Yes! Okay. He can't do anything about this, so I have to, <laughs> to make sure that's the case. Put on the stealth mission. On the Omnath. I'm gonna put that on the again. That would have been even better. Stamping tan. And we can't hit you. Bing. And go in. And the Risen Raffers. For the face. Oh! Oh, we got him! I thought we were dead there. Minus two! <laughs> Team Whispers. Oh my god, my heart was beating a million, million miles per hour. <laughs> I thought we were gonna get killed by Team Whispers. Joker, wow, wow, 990. Oh, and then we get a, the absolute worst hand we could ever. I mean, uh. Well, your opponent goes first. Nah, never keep a two lander. Never ever keep a two lander. Cause they'll get blood blue. Oh, well. Well, we need to draw good now. Else we won't be doing much here. Oh wait, didn't we face up against Joker 1? That was just an odd Joker. Man, there's a lot of Joker running around. Uh, should probably put this down and search for blue. Blue? I believe. Just gonna need that for the Omnith and everything. But this is... Uh, <clears throat> yeah, this is Fire's Invention. And we don't have a fast dirt. Is there any way we can get a fast dirt? Oh, wow, I'm almost putting down the wrong ladder. That would have been devastating. I think we're in trouble. <laughs> I think we're in trouble. That's my thing. Don't have anything. Pretty much, if it has a board sweep here, we pretty much dead. Well, that's not entirely true. We're almost dead. Is down. Well, he could have only lands and hands. This, I uh, mean, it happens. Only lands? I didn't have anything there, at least. Okay. Okay, so, question mark. I th Vivian or Royal Science? I think Vivian is the correct thing to go for. Vivian. Let's put the counters. Question is if we hold this guy back. My, my. How you've grown. It's gonna go in with a haster dude. And kill Vivian, most likely, but uh, no, nah, I think we still go in. I think that's still still the best choice. Okay. 13. Cavalier Gales. Oh that we can get bigger then, so that's not 
down with the world, I guess. Okay. But if he has an other... Oh, if he has the... Oh, he has two other, yes. That's gonna be a little more... Uh, a little more difficult to get around, I guess. So we need something here. Oh, really? <laughs> really, you need something? That's news. Uh, if it had the uh, stealth mission, I think we could have pummeled through here. As it stands, we don't have any stealth missions. Mm. We could buff this up with Royal Science and fight one of the Cavalier Gales to kill them. Uh, that's probably the thing we have to do here. The problem is it's just setting up for next turn. <laughs> just setting up. Man, if we could have drawn good with this deck against this guy, that would have been so sweet. That would have been so sweet. We wasted all our good draws on the uh, on the scrub decks, unfortunately. Uh, that will the power target creature, planeswalker. Schmink. Okay. Scries in response. Aim and their claws boom, boom, boom. Oh, he shops back first, so he's gonna scry afterwards. And then do we go in with this? Well, there's no. We'll use not going with it, I guess. We can't protect in the air, anyways. Does he block also? Crash it now, okay. Didn't think it would block that. Shops it back. Oh, we didn't think about the first strike. <laughs> That's why. I don't think he thought about the first strike. I think he just missed that. That gives us a chance, at least. It's sneaky, this first strike. Especially since we went with both this and this. Mm -hmm. Joker 1 then. Cavalier of Gales. Yep. <laughs> this is getting problematic. Hopefully he doesn't have the red guy. The red Cavalier. That's where it gets dangerous. Oh, he didn't? He didn't find the red Cavalier? Oh, that gives us a chance. A small chance. But a challenge, nonetheless. A trifling matter. <laughs> Let's see here. Mm. What can we do here? We can put on count as an Arcanist. We can... Omneth. That won't do much. I think this is the obvious thing. We need to put the count on there. Yes. Yes, yes. This will be fun to watch. Now, can we somehow deal enough damage? We can get a lot of Dreadnought Arcanists. Hmm. Well, he doesn't know that we have Omneth. So, if we go in with this... Let's see. We give this guy First Strike and Trample. He goes up to... Seven. If you now put down Omneth after he blocks, if he blocks, so let's say he double blocks, which he probably doesn't do, he just blocks with one of them. Or he doesn't block with any of them. Nah. I think we cost a duplicate, getting two of these. It's not probably gonna help that much, but. Still, we can do it. And uh, then we go in with this. With the Omnath, this is not an elemental, unfortunately. This is a zombie wizard. So, yes, clone you. Yet, yet, yet. Hmm. Only blocks with that this time. It's down to. What is it down to? Eight? Something? But we've just been so lucky that it hasn't hit his red cavaliers yet. <laughs> That's just. I think that luck is gonna run out very, very soon. Um, man, if it had a stealth mission, though. Oh, that would have been so sweet. So sweet. If this, um, if this quasi duplicate would have been a stealth mission. Oh. Oh. That would have been so sweet. It was not, though. Okay, Clarion, close those up. Okay. Let's have more of those. We might. Okay. Edergust. 
Put on top, question mark. Hmm. Hmm. Do we put that on top? That's the question. I think we decline putting it on top. I think we just goes away. I think that's the way. The way we have to do things. Okay. Vivian. And nothing else. Okay. Thunder can awaken her. That's what I wanted to see here. Because uh, this guy can go in with haste. And let's see here. We can deal two damage with Omneth, but that's not going to be enough. We don't have any elementals in the graveyard. That's a problem. None of them. Uh, we could also draw this card, I guess. Because uh, Thunder, it doesn't matter if this guy does three damage, so draw this card. Let me synthesize the facts. Hmm. Ah, Dragon Highlands goes. Well, put the under you. It won't make much of a difference, but it'll make a little bit of damage. A little bit. Maybe it's just hit lands or something. It's been super unlucky. Could be the case. Probably not, but you know. Could be the case. Okay. Now we need a stealth mission. Oh! <laughs> well, I think this word ends for us, unfortunately. I don't think we can outvalue this Castle Vantress. At some point, it's gonna hit this business. I think it's just inevitable. Okay. Six mana, so what could that be? Banner Cleansing? That would be too good, though. <laughs> he cleans his own board also. Do you want to do that? I go space. Is that really worth it? Oh, maybe this. I guess since he can play this and I have nothing on board, so. Then he loses this also. Maybe has a very good hand or something. I can play something afterwards, I guess. For six. Put down on the Cavalier or something. That would be much done. Yeah. Yeah, now we're in trouble. Now we're in trouble. Didn't hit our... We didn't hit our draw and... Bam, we do really bad against this guy. We didn't hit our draw and we didn't hit our self mission. Well, we still have a chance, I guess. But, nah. Nah. It's done. <laughs> God damn it. Now, Nashia, let's hope we're a little bit more lucky this time. 36%? I didn't even think that was possible. Well, you proved me wrong, Nana. How did you get the 36%? How? I mean, I, I actually got to, what did I get to? 68 or something? But man, it was easy to win at 68. 68 is basically like people like you have to be fast with scooping so that they don't scoop faster. <laughs> That's essentially what 68% mythic is like. How? But this seems to be somewhat common. Yeah, Caesar growth. How have you lost so much with this? Uh, maybe we will find out. Okay. Maybe, 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 maybe. <clears throat> Shifting to eight ops, that's strong. We have mostly blue things in this deck. The only thing that can block it is this, I guess. Ooh, but now we have the Thunder Gun Awakener. It's gonna kill this, most likely. So let's see here. If we... Let's see here. Now we just Omnath there. First, we just Omnath. First, the was a myth. Turn it scripts. And get this done also. Okay. And put a counter on an elemental. That would be you. And I'm going to attack in with this. Because this can still block, but it um but I can't block with this, and I can't block with this. So if this attacks in, he will kill this with shifting or eight ops, then we return it with Thunder Gun Awakener. Perfect plan. Perfect, perfect plan. <laughs> now we saw through it! 36! You're a mastermind! Oh, what? Ward scale crocodile? Didn't attack in with this? 
Okay, now things are starting to uh, come together. Starting to understand, maybe. But he's... But this hasn't really been performing for him. Well, a little cavalier then. I wonder what his plan is. I mean, it has a... It seems to have some kind of plan. I want to target his things. Surely. Uh, put cl plus counter on... Uh... I'll buff myself here. The thing is, this guy has protection from blue, so it's probably better to just buff this guy. He's the only one who can actually do something. Put this down. Let's counter on you. We also draw a card from this. We didn't have eight, though. Okay, we're gonna go on with this. Still see if <laughs> he's willing to buff. Kill this, please! No! <laughs> he is kind of smart, I must say. I mean, he's... Japanese boss of mine, so of course he's smart, but... He didn't fall for this trick. That did lack. Okay, and that gives lifelink. Oh, does he also have flying? Glaring Aegis! <gasps> and he's gonna tap down the Calvary of Thorns. Oh, he's getting in! Seven damage. This is pretty all we're gonna lose to this. All that glitters. Oh, enchantments target you draw from this way. I didn't even know that. Oh, they're still not going in with that, okay. That would have been pretty good, but no. Vigilance, life, it just, it still doesn't have trample? I thought you get fly, no, this doesn't give flying, okay. I can just block, okay, well, I'll, I'll block then. I'll block. It's gonna be <laughs> a little bit difficult to defeat. Let's see here. Uh, how much can we buff up the Cavalier Thorns? That's the question. How much can we buff up the Cavalier Thorns? We can buff this up to 9. It won't be enough, but what we can do... We'll also cross duplicate the Cavalry of Thorns, I guess. Or we can return the Omnath with the Thunder Gun Awakener. Mm. I think... Yeah, I shouldn't have played like I did, but, but I think here's where I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put this down on this guy. Uh, what goes here? I don't need two Thunder Gun Awakens, I don't think. Get another Cavalier. He's gonna find the business. And the card. <laughs> Man, if we lose this. That would be a little bit embarrassing. Um, Let's see, we could get four manas here, actually. So maybe do this. We pay the two life. No, we can't. Frack my brains. Frack my brains. Okay, well, now we have this. Dread of Arcanist. Down in the ground. And... Draw and this card. It's not what I should have done there either, but... I did it anyway. Oh, my brains. My brains. Oh. Well. Uh... Nah. No attacks. Oh, I could have attacked him with this, though. But I didn't. The ward scale crocodile. We could double block it, I guess. We could do that. <laughs> I love that this is like the most complicated match to win. Are you winning against the ward scale crocodile? It's way too huge. Okay, that's actually dangerous. Because you can't block it with too many things. Uh, that's a 10 9 protection on blue. Okay. <laughs> Not just like, finally, I got someone. Someone, okay, I can kill with this. <laughs> Nobody falls to this, except for very slow elemental starts. <laughs> with mostly blue creatures. Wow, he, and then he didn't kill me again. He didn't attack him. For reasons we will never fully understand. The mind simply cannot comprehend. Um... Well, Omnath can't target anything here. So let's see, we can buff this up. Let's see here. We buff this guy up so we can give the stealth mission to our cavaliers. You will not block our noble path. You will not block our noble path. Uh, and then... We put down Vivian. And let's see here. Oh, we can't fight because all these. Oh, we actually we can't fight. The shiftings are eight up. We can't fight this, but we can't 
Mm hmm. So how do we get to a point where we can fight this? Uh, if we put on stealth mission on this, we can fight it actually. Uh, so we're gonna go in with these two. Ah, these three actually. And that's gonna give us the stealth mission. Stealth mission. On this, it gives it up to nine power. And it can block this, really, that's fine. But now we can actually fight Shifting Ceratops. Oh, this again does not have Vigilance. <laughs> Which I again forgot about. I've always confused Reach with Vigilance, for some reason. <laughs> we might lose this. I'm just saying, I'm a little bit of a dingus. And if I'm under pressure versus the 36% Mythic champion. <laughs> I might just fall. Just say. Just say. But I love how this how we went from the 990th best player to uh, playing against 36% mythic. Uh, I think we're just gonna do this. Kill the shifting to eight ops. Eight ops, sir! I'm gonna fall. I don't know how we get past the ward scale. Well we can. Actually, Dread of Arcanist can save us next turn with that. I put down this. Put down this. And we're gonna put down this. <laughs> I played everything in the wrong way. Yeah, it's, I probably a hundred million misplays. Like, I've stopped counting at this point. There's so many misplays. Uh, but interesting that Season of Growth targets, like, that it counts enchantments. I don't know that there's many enchantments. That you want to do this with a uh, stealth mission, I guess. <laughs> Not too many that you want to do this with, but that's pretty cool. Yeah, we can definitely build a deck. I think this uh, thing that I got going here, we could def definitely expand on this. I'm imagining having the uh, the one which makes enchantments cheaper. It's not that... It just concedes here. God damn it! That's why you never rack up, because you always concede and you never attack! Michelle <laughs> Dunk! Thank you everyone so much for watching and a special thank you of course to our dear members Oh here they come here they come oh! Blue Dragon 077 Adam Alexis Ramen Noodles for me Magic Pisserman Simon Lauer I have tried to increase this window Rodney Cox Herman M Agony Reborn The Soft Pillow, Snicks, Snick, Luria Stars, Shamanix, Spencer Hofsty, Alex Michael, Nathaniel Nissen, Laser Set of Stun, Eric0234, Jeff Henry, Leaning Into It, Santa John, Michael W, Pocky U, Matthias Borley, Top its Investments, Chronos1107, W Lutes 1978, PP Peter Goal, Strange Brontides, Sean Stevens, Gabriel Juvenal, Tandex, Mark JC, Team Stokes, Wisa, Q Delated 23, Brian Gutierrez, Amano84, Seth, Hickok, Way, Ian Cusack, Mesomok, Ye Old Basses, Dingo Scrub, Orion SFL, Crew the Barbarian, Link is Weak, Raymer2002, 40k Television, Actors Ascending, New Light, Moonlight, Star, Donkey Kong, Wilka Ribeiro, Jace Unraveler of Secret Vines, Carlos Martinez, JK2000, Dave Steer, Nicolas Sanotti, Jurassic Fort, The Swamp King, Walker Floren, Rage Notch, Simple Human, Badass Iwanab, John Domian, Gesuzaki, Aaron Noble, Betsuma, Bloody Sick, Brandon Dobbs, Callus Missile, Carlo Palumbo, Dan Goodsell, David Newman, DBK Drama, Drew Styles, Eventum Tantum, Freeman Stephenson, Jeff Jordi, Kason, Kip Kastner, Magneto, Miss and Mrs. Smith, Potty, Prince, Mok, Pagok, Esquire, Rainbow, Cake, Serge Carmaro, Wonderbread, X Covenant X, Timothy, Sam Williamson, Super Noodle 7, MC Hermes, Face 6, Dr. Jadron, David Hanold, Infinite Draw, Neo Terror, Lin Ninja Long Gnome, Claw, J Cap, Fumiaki, Kinoshita, Dam Drone, Steve Draminski, Sky Surfer Zero, Tim Dutton, Jake Denley, or Orange Mango, Coop Cooper, Coop the Grace, Javier Diaz, Steiner Bucken, and Mac the Mac Duncan. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much. <laughs> and if you also want to become a member and help rule the underworld, then check out the join button next to the subscribe button or check out the Patreon link in the description. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Also, thank you. All the bad shoulders of Patreon. You guys are amazing. And don't forget to subbly dubbly, scribbly dibbly.